Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. So it is January 2024 and that can only mean one thing, it is that time of year yet again for the new batch of the YouTube Sports Card Hall of Fame nominations and balloting. Of course, one of the key pieces of the content calendar on the YouTube Sports Card side and one of the most uh, solemn and most sacred of uh, duties that it is for several of us in this um, community, we'll call it, uh, to participate in, of course. And as always, I once again reiterate that I take this with the most seriousness and solemnness that it deserves. And given that the video opening the nominations process happened mere hours ago, I have spent the last several minutes tirelessly preparing for this very, very crucial year in the voting, yet again for the year 2024. As always, this list has been carefully curated using the list of Carlos. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find it, so um, we're going to go off the top of the dome here. Uh, but again, as I said, solemnness, lots of preparation, really maximum effort is really what I'm trying to say here. Maximum effort in order to get this list for you. Now again, given the careful thought and consideration on this, as I approach this list, I'm going to remind you that they all meet the criteria, which is you have to be at least a three-year minimum of producing sports card related videos in order to qualify for it, and then in order to vote you have to be doing at least one year minimum of sports card related content. All of these channels meet that criteria and therefore they are included in my list. Now given that this is my third time creating one of these ballots, and just to confess a point here, my original idea once I realized that the list was going to basically stay the same is this is where I was going to just go and directly cut to the clip of the other video, just remove the Diamond Yard one, and basically just repurpose and make you rewatch the same video as last year, minus the Diamond Yard. And um, I'm not ashamed to tell you that I thought about it for quite a long time. I actually really, really thought about it. The thought amused me. And uh, it would be really on brand for this channel to put that kind of effort into it to just basically download and replay and basically con you all into watching the same video that I already made. However, because it is, as I said, the most prestigious made-up Hall of Fame that Bob Lewis is in, I am going to give you a wholly original video and you're getting it. So, like I said, we got the list. I'm going to go through it. Uh, a lot of the same rationale applies as last year. However, I'll go through a couple of them once again. And then we'll uh, conclude this business for another year. So first of all, we're going to start off with two names that are synonymous with kind of old school sports card YouTube, and at the same time, like myself, men of peace, distinction in, we'll go with that, men of peace, distinction. Anyway, so we've got, first of all, the Insert Revolution Podcast. Just slow your roll, slow, slow your roll, you hear? Yes, indeed, need I say any more? And of course, the Insert Revolution Podcast. Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Indeed, no true words were ever spoken. Now, for the rest of you, don't worry, I didn't pull clips from everybody. But I just thought because it's Dave and Steve, I just thought it'd be kind of fun. By the way, I would recommend for some, especially for some of these folks, go back in the archive and check it out. Both good friends of the channel, as well as uh, long-term hobbyists who have been on YouTube for quite some time. So, to me, I had them last year, and I'm going to have them again on this year on the list. Next up, Dead Guy Cardboard. Great combination of some 90s shine. Love it. Uh, big fan of that. Also some great vintage. Uh, doesn't make videos all the time, but I still think the videos on there are certainly quality, and I'm still a big fan of the logo. So a lot of the same rationale as last year. Now last and certainly not least on my list here is Bert Cat 8 Like I said, I had him on here on the list last year. Fellow Packer collector. Uh, definitely much more hardcore in the Packer collecting side of things. I kind of stick to my favres. Uh, and that's kind of the area that I enjoy. Although I do have um, a PSA set registry on the 57 Tops uh, Packer team set. But... One of the key cards of that Packer team set is the Bart Star rookie, and he has quite the collection of Bart Star cards and Bart Star autographs. So I would definitely recommend checking out the channel if you want to check out a variety of some very fun uh, football, because he's got a lot of football card related projects. So if you're into kind of the football card genre, he's definitely got some great videos for you throughout the course of time, and you can check out a lot of different cool cards. Has a great enthusiasm for it, and again, is a great long-term community guy that has been a part of uh, this whole thing. Yep, I'm a jerk. I did warn you. It is, it is the long con, and I laid the primrose path down there. And it's a beautiful thing when it all comes together, when it takes just that extra amount of time. A year plus in the making, really. And that's kind of my favorite part about it. Now with that said, I will include one more nominee here uh, that I believe meets the criteria as well. We'll include uh, Big Scott 35 friend of the channel, and plus it allows me to play this clip. Hey guys, I'm gonna have to say goodbye. I'm about to my batteries, but I think you die. You know, I wanna say bye before I leave. Our power's no out. I keep Th getting it Thank going. you, Ed. Thank you, Scott, for joining. We in. got no power, you. Carlos. 
<laughs> and right now it's going great. Uh, you you hang out, you hang in there. Uh, Aaron Rodgers will protect you. You're fine. You're all in the darkness. You're fine. <laughs> Certainly worthy for that clip alone. And that concludes my nominations for the 2024 YouTube Sports Card Hall of Fame. And I'm basically out of gimmicks for now. Uh, so I've got basically a year to come up with a new one. Uh, and I don't think I quite have the long con available to me that I was able to use this time around. So that's it for this time around. More videos coming up on the channel. Live streams on Fridays at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, as is the norm around here. And we'll have another one here upcoming on Friday where maybe we'll touch on this topic a little bit since now the season has entered. And I'm sure there will be no controversies whatsoever. I expect complete decorum in the process and everything related to it and no drama whatsoever, as is always the case with these things. With that all said... Like if you like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thanks very much, and we'll catch you in the next one.